Hi everyone, I want to do a review on my experience with James Allen. So this is the box that I received. It comes in inside this box right here. And I just took it out. It comes in a very nice box. So once you open it, this is where the ring is. And then there's a little drawer down here where it has the receipts. A little towel to clean your ring. I use it every time to wipe off all the smudge, which is great. And then there's also a piece of envelope. Very nice. And in here is just what they recommend for the insurance of the ring. Who you can purchase just insurance from, which is Jeweler Mutual. This is also your receipt in here in this envelope right here and then inside this clear thing it's all the information of your ring which is the GIA certificate hi so I'm gonna give you a closer look of the ring so this is a round diamond with a halo setting. This diamond is at a point ninety. The color F. Under one carat. Sorry, the focusing is not too great. looks like this. You can see the diamond underneath it. So when I bought this diamond, I originally wanted a 1 carat. The one that I was looking at was... The diamond that I was looking at was a 1 carat. Excellent cut, great color, and great clarity. But once I um, spoke to James Allen, they, the lady, told me that it's an okay ring, but the diamond has a deep cut. So that means the light won't bounce out of it as nicely and it will have dark shadows in it. So what she did is she helped me choose a few other rings that are closer to it well diamond that are closer to it so we went with a point 90 she said you won't really see a big difference and you'll save a lot more money so that's what we decided to just do as long as the diamond looks nice So the customer service is great. They're very honest. The representative. Um, they're very helpful. Um, we ordered the diamond, this diamond with just the diamond band with no halo. Once we received it, it looks nice, but it wasn't like the wow factor. So we decided to just return it and with the same diamond on a halo band which looks so much better gives it that little oops to it and it was only like I think it was only like $200 different but I, I will insert the picture of the the ring di the video or the picture of the diamond which is the diamond band with no halo So what I would do, would recommend, will I recommend anyone to purchase a ring from James Allen? Um, I like their customer service. I feel like you can see the diamond a lot clearer than what you see when you go to the store. I went to um, Shanko. They gave me um, education on the diamond, information of it. 
but the price of the diamond, I believe for a 0.8 was already at $5,000 for a diamond. Five to six thousand dollars, I believe, and it was way out of our budget just for the diamond because we we're expecting to spend less than um, seven thousand for both. And the quality of the diamonds through Shanko wasn't as great, so we were happy with what we see at James Allen knowing what's out there and then seeing it in the quality image that they provide for us which is great yeah it's not gonna focus so yeah so that's my ring that I got James Allen nothing wrong with it no diamond has fallen out because I have um, seen reviews saying that the diamond is falling out and things like that um you can take it to any drawers that they recommend for cleaning there is a few in my location so if you go online you can check or give them a call and they'll let you know what's available and that's it and let me show you how it looks like on my hand my ring size is a four and a half so just like that I think it looks great for my hand not too small not too big just like a perfect size and when you're outside with the recessed lightings um, it sparkles a lot 